This is cool. All right, so here we have some of the developers that made this game here, along with the Steel Wool Studios being the OG creators of FNAF Security Breach and the Ruined DLC. How's it going, everyone? And welcome to another FNAF fan game called Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach Ruin 2. So this is a fan-made sequel to the original Ruin DLC for FNAF Security Breach. And so this game uh, just came out uh, not too long ago, uh, sometime yesterday as of recording this video. It is in the middle of the morning and the well next day. So yeah, that's... Uh... So this game does take place after that one ending where, uh, you know, the Mimic gets his arm snipped off and uh, Gregory decides to pull the plug and just you know, get that elevator to crash all the way to the bottom of that uh, elevator shaft, and uh, Cassie had to suffer through that accident. Golly, man, I hope that she survived after that insane uh, event there. And, uh, you know, at the very end of those credits, uh, Roxy could be heard calling out to, you know, Cassie just to make sure that she is okay. That is my girl coming in to save the freaking day once again. And just that whole fight scene with Roxy and the Mimic, Golly, that was like one of the best FNAF moments of all time. And that's where this game is going to be starting off from there. So yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started with this fan-made sequel then, shall we? So yeah, just like with the oh, original game, we can actually go in... What? This is really cool. So yeah, this is... The same exact menu screen uh, layout, just like from the original FNAF Security Breach game. And so, uh, what happens if I do play that? Oh, it's going to take me directly to the Steam page. Alright, I guess I can go ahead and well, get started with Ruin 2. Oh, this is so cool. They even got like a whole bunch of options right over here. However, uh, I'm just going to be, you know, sitting with the usual settings like I always do. So, yeah, let's go ahead and play through Ruin 2. Warning, we recommend completing Security Breach and Ruin first for the best narrative experience. Well, don't you worry, I got all of that New Age FNAF lore crammed into my brain. So yeah, uh, don't have to worry about a game whatsoever. And here we go. Oh, this is really cool. Uh, and there goes Cassie just hacking on one of those uh, terminals that can be seen uh, throughout the entirety of ruined oh and the logo changes to roxy too okay this is like the best sequel ever that i've ever played through here <laughs> find the exit and we're gonna get started with chapter one cassie fell even deeper help her get out oh i cannot wait to get started with this man i always wanted to play some more uh fnaf security breach madness here oh but once you see this icon do not interrupt the process to correctly save the game what they even, like, implemented the freaking cutscene from the ending? Okay, uh, so this is, like, uh, what happened in the last episode. Okay, yeah, yeah the Mimic got his arm chopped off. This is so cool. Okay, I got that seatbelt all strapped in. Okay, this is gonna be sick. Yeah, I do know that, Gregory. Thanks for letting me know. Oh, man, this is exciting. Yeah, I still feel bad for doing that. <laughs> it's not your fault. I know you did it for me. To save me. But we can't risk being followed. I'm sorry. And this is where Gregory? the elevator line gets cut. And... Yeah. Still horrible just like it was originally. Golly, oh my gosh. What? Ah. Uh, Okay. Uh. Look, Cassie, you're all fine. Just. Okay. Wait, where are we at right now? Okay, so we're crawling out from that, uh. We're in the FNAF 6 pizzeria. Uh, really? Or what looks like the FNAF 6 pizzeria? Because this pit right here does seem like the similar type of one that was in the FNAF 6 pizzeria. And here we are with FNAF Security Breach Ruin 2. What? Okay, let me just, uh, what? Okay, pick up that flashlight, uh, and just shake that as much as you can to get the batteries all working. Okay, good, and now I can, you know, walk around everywhere. This floor is all warped. 
<laughs> I mean, uh, this place has been abandoned for quite some time, so yeah, that makes a whole lot of sense. All right, so let me uh, turn on the generator and uh, just you know take in the surroundings here as I see a whole bunch of dust particles and make sure you're not breathing that uh, whatsoever. That ugh. you know, I'm out of here. So after uh, being plunged from that uh, elevator system all the way down here, I uh, luckily got out unscathed, and so, yep, here I am just casually walking around trying to turn all these generators on. So, uh, what restaurant is this now? <laughs> okay, uh, and now that generator uh, powered on. Probably another door to uh, pretty much open for me. Okay, so where do I need to go now? Oh, right over here. Okay, uh, can I just not fall into that pit where I uh, climbed out from? Alright, good. So I got that one uh, enabled. Oh! Okay, so that turned on... Oh, I see. Those lights over there. Oh, what's this right here? Oh! I got the... Foxy talkie. Oh! Oh, come on, Roxy. Oh, man. Stuck up here. How do I get down? Yeah, maybe find, like, a convenient staircase to, well, take to get out of here? Oh, man. What is with all these uh, festive lights that are decorating the place? Who is that insane enough to come down here and try that out? Yep, I know it's vanity after all. So, yeah, now I'm uh, just walking around down here in this, uh, well, cavern system, so now I can... Oh, put on the fanny mask once again. Okay. Oh. Alright, so now just like... Oh. Something's gotta be powering it. Oh, great. I think we're in too deep. I'm not familiar with this place. Get to the main stage where you can run backup power. I don't want to talk to you anymore, LB. Why do you gotta be back here, huh? No, after that incident with Roxy, that has traumatized me so much. No, you can screw off for as much as I care. Oh man, this is so trippy here. Just gotta be walking around everywhere that I go. Alright. Hey, at least my uh, flashlight is still working. <laughs> Just walk around everywhere until I can find something to interact with. So I presume that those are some boards for a, uh, you know, nice, uh... Well, time for Roxy to pretty much barge in through. So, yeah, um, Roxy, I, I need your uh, assistance right now. I mean, I found a ventilation system to take for myself. So, yeah, let me uh, continue on forward. Oh, what's over here? Uh, why is there a stack by head just jammed in the fan blades? Okay, well, I'll uh, be on my merry go. Uh, who is watching me? You? Look away. This instant, okay? I, wait a minute. What is this? Why is there a Freddy suit stand right here? Am I in Fazbear Frights now? <laughs> really? That would make so much sense if I can... Oh. Uh, okay. I don't think that was supposed to happen. Be careful with Chica. She's capable of disabling the generators, I see. Oh, I don't think that was supposed to happen. Yeah, I crawled into some place where it just kicked me out automatically. All right, so let me uh, get back up to that point since, yeah, that was a little bit too weird. Yeah, if I had, like, a roll of duct tape in my back pocket, then I would use that to pretty much block out the camera lens from watching me all creepily. So, yeah, now I'm back here. And, uh, where is this place uh, supposed to be, huh? Oh, yeah, nice uh, fancy graffiti right there. Whoever drew that on the wall. Warning, a Mexus protection disabled. Yep, I, I accidentally did that. <laughs> yeah, my bad, uh, Gregory, for, you know, just taking care of that uh, friendly goober that was trying to follow me around. Uh, so there goes the puppet mask. Uh, okay, so I'm just gonna... Oh, uh, not go that way, since that is clearly blocked off from me to, well, not access that route anymore. Oh my gosh, not... <laughs> really? Wait a minute. Oh, they're <laughs> No, these arcade machines are back. I mean, hey, uh, I still like them, by the way. I just still want to know why pre-weathered Foxy is here if all Foxies instead of the original Foxy being on this arcade machine. You know what? I I'm out of here. <laughs> Didn't make why? <laughs> Did not expect for them to make a grand return. 
All right, so I just had to pretty much crouch right there and got past those little lines. Up, uh, hiya there. How you doing, uh, Bonnie? Just standing guard. Yep, thank you so much, buddy, for well pointing me uh, in the right direction and not taking another path that'll lead to certain doom. Okay, so just stand right across that. What and, is that? Oh, uh. Oh yeah, I can actually uh, go onto this uh, monitor here. Turn off the door electrical protection. Uh, yeah, sure thing. I need to progress on forward here. Oh, uh. That was too close. I was almost a Cassie sandwich. Yeah, you sure were. But hey, guess what? You're uh, still doing just as fine. You know, that's all that matters. Uh, join us at Fred Bear's Family Diner. So we have another one of those uh, vintage posters all the way down here. I still want to know, how deep does this whole, uh, cavern system, uh, go down into anyways? I'm still baffled by- oh no. How deep this whole place goes to- okay, so now I can crawl inside of this event system, uh, you know, just like with Gregory, uh, you know, telling me the nice, uh, you know, way of just, I don't know, sprint crawling? Oh, what? I'll probably use that right now since there are some evil- beings down here. Yeah, I don't want to say their names or else they're going to appear right in front of me. They look like a miniature, well, clowns. It's because uh, yeah, guess what? The freaking plush babies are back. Yeah. How am I uh, not surprised by that at all? So yeah, now I can go all the way back to where that door was. Oh my gosh. No, really? Oh, come on. Hey, Who's crawling over there? He's wearing my mask. It is not uncommon for bots to be sent into the underground to check the condition of the building. It's extremely dangerous for the administration to send technicians uh, from the former Mega Pizza Plex. Oh. What are you talking about? None of this makes sense. It's easy to connect to the bot through the mask and inspect the area, but I'm not too sure about its safety. Well, why do you want me to go after that bot in the first place? Look, I have seen so many horrors right above the uh, you know surface level in the Mega Pizza Plex, and uh, guess what? I don't think crawling after this uh, you know mysterious uh, bot is gonna be any different whatsoever. Helpy, you are a bad influence. Screw you. I am not gonna be listening to you. Any more than I have to, okay? <laughs> Alright, so, uh, I'm gonna go keep on going. I'm not going into that other vent system or else, uh, you yeah, know, I don't want to get an instant game over that'll kick me back to the main menu screen. Alright, so... Yeah, great. Now I can open up this door. Oh, what the? Really? So now the plush babies are gonna be hunting me? What? Uh... Is that- Oh my gosh! The Really? Freaking map bot is what? Huh? Due to the damage to the Vanny unit, the fasteners may have failed. Usually they come off by themselves, but you have a special situation. Oh yeah, it's permanently uh, you know super glued to my face. Yeah, right now I can't even like uh, you know take that off whatsoever. It's probably with that a uh, digital super glue that I wasn't aware of. So yeah, we got some more of these uh, barricades. How far does this place go down, huh? What? Oh, hi there. You know what? You are, uh, mine? Uh, can I not disable you? Just like with the other pat pats or wet floor bots? Uh, okay then. Ain't no way they got the... the really? Hey, nice spin, by the way, uh, fluorescent light. Got the Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Place sign down here. That's cool to see. Alright, good. So I got that generator turned on. Uh, so what does this counter mean right here? Okay, I'm just gonna... Can you stop it? No, I don't want to be haunted by these plush babies anymore. Stop doing that to me, please. Alright, and now we got that uh, generator turned on. Uh, excuse me? If you're gonna be rascals and turn off my freaking generators, then... That's not good whatsoever. Yeah, I know that's you, Shattered Chica. What is with you right now, huh? Sorry, out of order. And there goes the uh, oh, pile of toy animatronic parts that are inside of that box. Oh, great. Just imagine that. Then hunt me down along with the, you know, a lot of the other iterations of the other animatronics. All right, so now I think I can, you know, press this button here. Okay, good. So now I gotta probably survive from... Maybe Glamrock Chica? That's about to... A user 
block in the system has been detected. Security measures are being applied. What? What? Wait, where? What? Excuse me? Uh, oh my gosh! Ooh. Okay. Yeah, not safe anymore. You freaking marked me right where I stood. What did I just pick up? So I looked down at the Chica head and I picked up something. Okay, I'm not sure if that was a collectible or something else entirely. Okay, so I got all the generators turned on. Okay, I just need to be safe. That Glamrock Chica is not gonna be anywhere nearby. Okay, Okay, now run. All the way over here. Just don't let Glamrock Chica get you. Okay, where are you gonna come from? Gonna play a sick looping game with you, uh, Glamrock Chica? I hate this place. Oh no. I don't know where you are right now. Uh, looks like the old dungeon critical failure protection system has kicked in. Communication with the servers will be lost. By default, it takes a couple of minutes for the power to restart, keep the generators running, and the exit will open when the time expires. Okay, good. So now I gotta wait for those generators to pretty much flip online, and uh, Glamrock Chica's gonna be, well, pretty much... Oh no. Turn on this generator. Yep, there we go. Oh no, this ain't good. Where are you are? Oh no, no. Can you run? Okay, well, not anymore. I don't know, where's that at? Oh hi, how you doing? Oh, it's so cool. Okay, let me just go over here, and uh, you can mind your own business. Come on. Come on, just turn on this generator. Please. There we go. Oh no. Yep, you're coming after me, aren't you? You stay over there. Come on, turn on, turn on, turn on! Okay, man, really? Okay. So now let me just... You know, stand calm here. Just let Glamrock Chica just do her rounds. So I gotta survive three minutes of just constant generator failures! Okay, hi. No, you don't. Okay, where are you going then? Uh, okay. okay. So you're just going over there. Good. I just had to press uh, one of those generators uh, only once, and I should be good to go. All right, perfect. So if I start to hear, like, one of those generators uh, ooh, spiral out of control, then I got to go to one of them and just give them a light tap and just hear them. Okay, really? Oh, it's that one. Alright, good. No, you don't. That was the biggest juke of the century. Okay, good. Oh, no. No, you don't. Get away from me. Where are you coming in from? Okay. Yep, you're going in from that angle there. Okay. I'll just hang back. Just in this area. Oh, yeah, there goes that uh, cute wall art of uh, Freddy and Friends on tour. Okay. Where is that... Uh, Generator, oh, right over here. Okay, good. So now, I'm waiting for Glamrock Chica. Where are you at, huh? If you're just munching on more of that rotten trash, uh, that's probably decades old at this point. Okay, so only one more minute left. Okay, just stay over there in that one corner and just don't bother me for the rest of. Oh, come on. Really? Really, man? Where are you going? Alright, right over there. Good. Uh, okay, I guess you're gonna go, uh, yeah, much on that generator. That's just great. Okay, good. At least the power is still flowing on through. Oh, no. Yep, it's right where Chica is. Oh, nope. Oh, it's right over here. Good. Wait, where? Okay. Only got 15 seconds. Okay, just run. Okay, this is not that bad, actually. Just... Need to put my head on a swivel and just keep a lookout on where Glamrock Chica is. Oh! Oh no. Okay, just go. Alright, just go to the door. Run on through. And... Problem solved! Oh! Okay. Uh, maybe Glamrock Chica might have heard that and she's uh, making her way over here right now, or... Maybe not. They're still here. What, all the trapped souls that, uh, you harvested? Uh, 
Mimic. I can't oh. Get the mask off again. Gregory. Oh, what? It's Gregory. Hey, that's my boy. Wait. Wait, what? Is she falling for the mimic's uh, tricks? Are you kidding me? So the mimic is mimicking my voice. And, uh, hello, how you doing? And the skeleton wearing my vanity mask. So you're technically seeing me with that vanity mask on, aren't you? Ah, oh, that's perfect. Wait, where are you going, Cassie? Wait, what? I had to hold that button to close the... What, really? That's great. So there is a Vanny endoskeleton that's pretty much chasing after me. Yeah, I swear, man. So I guess that's part of the mimic line of endoskeletons. Just putting on the mask is I'm doing the same here. That's great. Okay. Okay, just close this out. Don't let the... Oh, man. I think that was way too close. Okay, just continue on going. What the? Ah! Wait, where did you come from? Oh no. What the? Oh, did I just get destroyed by uh, some rubble that fell in from the ceiling? Really? Let's go, please. Oh, you're coming from right there. Okay. Uh, running this way towards the white doorway. Okay, uh. Can I get in here? Uh, can I not get in here? Wait, what? What's going on now? Oh, hi. Oh, there. Oh, no. Please. Don't get me. Oh, great. Oh. Run. We're over here. Oh, okay. So that was the right doorway that I needed to go to. Uh, what's going on? Oh, hi there, Mimic. How you doing? Uh, oh, there goes the adorable cardboard cutout of Roxy. And, uh... Oh, Cassie this time that's wearing the vanny mask. Oh, shoot. I think I need to run for my life. Okay. What? You got Chica's feeding frenzy over here? Okay. Oh. No, I had to do some... Oh, parkour here? Oh, no. Yep, I know what to do. And I uh, fell to my demise. Okay. Just what? Wait, what? What is happening? Uh, oh, there goes Freddy and friends on tour playing. Oh, hi, uh, mimic. Oh, why are you dropping stuff on top of me like that, huh? I made it run on time. I was able to get the vanny fasteners working again. The mask is not working in order. I strongly recommend that you remove it. Well, that's what I'm trying to do, Helpy. Wait, what? Uh, what's going on now? Okay, well... Am I stuck in place? Okay, let me just... Oh, what? There's a giant vanny mask coming towards me? Yeah, get away from me. Oh. Was that the daycare attendant trying to... Where the vanny mask is what? Oh, hi there. <laughs> oh! Okay. Uh, what's happening now? Oh, no. Just get on out of there. Yeah, I know that this is all traumatic uh, for you, Cassie, and I still feel so bad for you. <laughs> hey, at least this music is very good. Uh, wait, what's going on now? Wait a minute. That was it! There's no way! <laughs> okay, uh, that was a really nice uh, bite-sized, uh, uh, you know, FNAF Security Breach uh, ruined gameplay there. That was sick. Absolutely a well done to, you know, everyone that was uh, a part of this uh, game right here. Special thanks to FNAF Play, and I just gotta say, uh, thanks to y'all so much for making this uh, really awesome game here. And, uh, is there going to be anything after the credits? Oh, and now we get the traditional credits here. So, um, yeah, we... 
ran away from like a gigantic vanny mask and so i guess that we're going to be taking an elevator probably to like the uh, upper parts of the well mega pizza plex i presume to turn on the power yet again and uh hopefully reunite with roxy I, come on now i thought i was gonna you know probably at least have some sort of interaction with roxy at some point but yeah that's fine at least i had you know a whole lot of fun with playing through this uh, fan-made uh, ruin experience here. This was a whole lot of fun. Oh, man. Just want to let all these credits roll on by here. And, uh, you know what? Absolutely, I'm just going to say this once again. Stellar job to, you know, pretty much steal Wool and Scott Compton for, you know, making, you know, all of FNAF's security breach, including the Ruin DLC and, uh, you know, the newer installments of the, you know, modern era of, uh, you know, FNAF games. So, yeah, um, where is Cassie gonna end up being at, though? That is, uh, you know, the most important question because I am concerned for her safety. If the Mimic is gonna be meeting her at the top, then, oh well, I man, I'm gonna be, uh, tackling to, you know, the Mimic to the ground and just, you know, let Cassie just run to the exit while I'm just, uh, you know, struggling to fight off the Mimic. <laughs> eh, whatever. I'll, uh, provide a great sacrifice and hope that you just run out of there as fast as you possibly can. So, yeah, um, I just still gotta say that this whole new era of FNAF is just so surreally weird to me. <laughs> like, what in the world is going on? You have, like, you know, reality and, you know, the digital world just, like, crossing into each other. And, uh, yeah, I have no honest idea what's going on anymore at this point. <laughs> Alright, so, now the credits had rolled on by. Is there gonna be, uh, anything else afterwards? A what? Wait a minute. This was from CG5's Ruin Lullaby animated music video. Wait, what? I recognize where that scene is from. So I guess that's where she's uh, remaining from here on out, huh? So that was pretty much all in for Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach Ruin 2. A phenomenal sequel to the original uh, Ruin DLC from FNAF Security Breach and I really did like the added on, uh, you know, continuation of after the elevator crash uh, segment and, uh, you know, we play as Cassie once again just going through a couple of more trippy segments uh, and, you know, compared to like the actual Ruin DLC itself, this one was a bite-sized experience and, yeah, I really did like the mini games of like, you know, just trying to avoid Chica at all times, of like, trying to flip on all those generators and she has like a real knack for trying to mess around with my own uh you know strat to exit this uh, madness huh and uh, that little mini chase scene of us uh, being well i don't know pursued by a glam rock skeleton wear a fanny mask <laughs> did not expect for that to you know come to play and uh you know glam rock chica was waiting on the other side as well and yeah uh and then we escaped from that digital hex zone just doing a little bit of parkour and yeah that did take me a good couple of tries however i uh managed to get out of there safely take that elevator and uh nearly get caught by that giant vanny mask i still have no idea what's going on here to be honest and uh yeah that's where this uh ruined sequel has left off there and yeah i had a whole lot of fun with this uh you know fan sequel here of you know the original ruined dlc and yeah that was pretty much all there is to it for FNAF Security Breach Room 2 and all of my thoughts on this uh, game right here. Golly, this was a whole lot of fun. So if anyone has enjoyed this video of me playing through this fan-made sequel of the Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach Ruined DLC, then y'all know what to do down there since all of your amazing like, comment, and definitely subscribe if y'all haven't already, or else you'll be going through that same trippy segment Having that fanny mask permanently stuck to your face, and good luck to you for finding another way out of there, or else that, uh, you know, fanny mask wearing glam rock endoskeleton or chica are uh, gonna be uh, getting cut up to you first, and, well, that's not gonna be great since uh, they're probably gonna be uh, calling up that gigantic fanny mask soon on you, and hit that bell to be notified of all my future content and streams, because I do sometimes stream my channel, and that's about it, so I'll see you all in the next video or stream. Thank you guys so much for watching this, and yeah, see y'all.